Faith comes by hearing, and hearing the Word of God. You're listening to The Moment of Power with Azano Eddie Thompson. Daily audio devotions to energize your day, presented by the Advent Hero Ministries. Our topic today is God's Hall of Faith, Part 3, Creation Ex Nihilo Faith. Through faith, we understand that the worlds were framed by the word of God so that things which are seen were not made of things which do appear. Hebrews 11 verse 3 What is common with all of God's heroes and heroines of faith is that They all believe in the creative power of God. They believe that God exists and he made all things. Without this fundamental belief, faith is anchored nowhere. For instance, how would we believe that God is coming someday to take us out of this place if we do not believe in the first place that he puts us here by creation? Today, many Christians, not to talk of a taste, are denying the creation faith. They postulate that the universe and life in all its complexities came by chance or accident, and that given time, things have evolved from the simple to the complex. But these evolutionary guesses or hypotheses have flunked the scientific test. For instance, the first and second laws of thermodynamics, well-known and established laws of physics, cancel the possibilities and even any probability of the universe as a system and life itself coming into existence all by themselves. The first law is the same as the law of conservation of mass or energy. We are told that mass or energy cannot be created nor destroyed. In other words, they cannot create themselves or by any human process and they cannot be destroyed. The second law of thermodynamics, also called entropy, it states that degeneration is inherent in matter and energy in the universe. In other words, any organized system that is left to itself tends to disorganization. What this tells us is that what we see in the universe is devolution and not evolution. So any existing system must have been created and sustained by the power of God. The earth orbits around the sun by the power of God. The atoms are kept in their place, in their orbit, by the power of God. Things do not have the capacity to create and arrange themselves as the evolutionists would have us believe. Another mind-blowing evidence of creation is the DNA coding system that is far more complex than any computer programming language system that can ever be created. It is God's signature of the creation in the cell. God has signed every cell as his. Evolutionists have been trying to convince thinking minds that you can have a program without a programmer. But that's really, really impossible. You have to stretch your mind to the limit to be able to believe such a thing. There are other questions the evolutionists cannot answer. How can blind chance create beauty, consciousness, thought, language, love, appreciation, etc.? God has given you a mind to think for yourself and the evidence are more than enough to help you believe and understand that the world were framed by the word of God so that things which 
as seen were not made of things which do appear. This is the moment of power. May the God of creation add more meaning and purpose to your life. In Jesus' name, please do have a nice day.